about that, our first matchup for today is Pyro Panda and Winter Fox. Say it louder for the people in the bag, bro. <coughs> our first tournament for today is between Looter Fox and Pyro Panda. Hey. The Pyro for the people in the back, Lunar Fox look like he rocking dual shotguns. Dual shotguns. I don't That's think we real. saw that last tournament, so I'm excited to see that. He's rocking a, a, a dance, not dance sleeve, Iron Dyke melee weapon. I'm hype about it. He's rocking flash grenades. I'm not sure if those are going to do anything in the tournament, but um, if he pulls it off, I'm going to be hype. I mean, flash grenades aren't that bad. It's just a matter of if you can hit the target, especially I'm... with their aerial. It also has a railgun, dude. I'm high. Pyro Panda in here. Rocking Shield. Aaron I Ogre Breaks. I'm loving the freaking Ogre Breaks I'm seeing. There's that Ogre uh, Break. Yeah, are, they're slept on, dude. I don't think uh, Ogre Breaks are useful at all. But mm, I think they're slept even, on. No, I don't even think they're slept on. I think they're just bad in general. Mm, mm, low I, damage, low knockback. I think they need more damage. Definitely, especially for a shoulder cannon. Yeah, I think they need more damage, but I do think they're they're pretty good, especially in two v twos. I don't know about one v ones. We'll see. All right, time to update the bracket. Let's go, first match. I'm hype. Lunar Fox is the new contestant, and Power Panda. I'm not sure. I haven't seen her fought. I told Panda I wasn't gonna stream her, spectate her. But I lied. <laughs> So she front and center first on the camera, baby. Let's get it. And Lunar Fox just trying to find his target. And now they're starting to fight. Iron Man got wow. sights on them. They both got mirages up. I think Panda's focusing on the mirage. I think she knows who's who though. Huh. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yo, I still got this crappy persona music on. Crappy persona music. It's not crappy, but it didn't fit. Didn't fit the uh the battle music, baby. Pirate Panda is blank down trap mines everywhere. When trap mines are effective, man, especially against people who are close range builds. He has shotguns and he has melee weapons, so it's not a bad counter to What's weird is that although he's wearing... He looks like she's getting hit with the Ogre Breaks. Well, also, it's weird because although he's using close range weapons, he's staying really far away. He's not going to be able to get any damage off unless no. he's trying to use the Ogre Break. He looks like he's taking a couple hits from the Ogre Break. Well, looks like the Ogre Break is missing for now. He's definitely using a slower build. That's not a really good compliment for close range weapons. And they're staying kind of low, maneuvering on the top of the buildings. Not sure. Ooh, pulled out the melee. Let's go. Ooh, she's not focusing on the mirage. Ooh, look like he got a hit with ogre breaks. Pull out the melee. She needs to. Dash cancel a little bit more with the melee. Oh, wondering if the shield is blocking any damage. Oh, it looks like he's getting hit by trap mines. Like, oh, Aaron dice slash in the face. Is in the red now. Oh, I forgot to change the time. <laughs> Oh, is it time? Oh, yeah. it's supposed to be time. Yeah. He's already in the red. Wow. You can tell if an opponent is in the red if when they mirage, their uh, their suit turns yellow. I did not know that. Yeah. Oh, he's going for the heels. He's going for heels, but I don't think going on the ground oh, is a good it. idea right now. Lunar Fox can't keep his target within a sight. 
Little Frog is flying a little too high. With your low health, you want to stay, kind of stay. I would stay out of the sky. It's easier for people to spot you. Uh, I would actually stay in the sky because it makes it harder for people to. Oh, he lost an arm. Ooh, that, but... Ogre Break finish. Not on in this map. I would take control of the buildings and try to block behind shots with the buildings. I wouldn't stay in the sky. Not on this map. I would think that maybe it would probably just be better if it was if Lunar uh, Fox forced uh, Pyrocan to the ground. I think Lunar Fox needs to be a little bit more aggressive. Ogre Break's not bad, yo. People sleep on it. It, it needs a buff, but it, I don't think it's bad. I honestly think it's bad. For how slow it is and how like um open it leaves you, I think it should do more damage. There's really no point in using it over Brennico. <laughs> but I like I like him. Ogre break is a very risk reward weapon. What the f I don't even know what just happened. <laughs> Who's that? That was genocide. <laughs> yeah, I'm saying it's the risk, the risk is not worth the reward in my opinion. Not as it is currently. It needs a buff or something. And I don't even know if they have it modded. Uh, have you seen the knockdown damage? Knockdown doesn't really do anything though. Knockdown just, just leaves you with iframes. <laughs> knockdown leaves you with iframes. Knockdown is overrated. But it's not even like knockdown is good. It's That's like what I'm saying. Knockdown is overrated. It leaves you with iframes. Or not overrated, but it's kind of useless. Oh, Lunar Fox is using. Oh, Lunar Fox pretty... switched to build. Oh wait, what? Let me see what we got. Ooh, and. Flamer. Oh, switch teams, switch teams. And Flamer, let's see that. Oh, he's not running any attachments with this build, except for two, which is like damage stuff. No attachments on, and um, Iron Pen is modded out. But I don't run I attachments know. either, unless they're already on the it's... weapon. So <laughs> attachments, attachments help, but they're they're not the deciding factor. Absolutely, Iron Pen takes the first point. So if I was Lunar Fox, I'd try to be a bit more aggressive. So watch like out! Gotta watch out for those help. trap mines. Field medic, but there's no devotion. You forgot to switch the time, didn't you? Well, <laughs> I know it. And they're off. Mm, look like Luna Fox is getting a little bit of the hits in. Oh, watch out for those trap mines. So it was cool about Mirage too. Mirage can get rid of a lot of those trap mines for you. Plus, also, it also works roundabout. Uh, Mirage is in way trap mines too. Yep. I think Pyro Panda is focusing on the Mirage. Just random spin in midair. <laughs> Uh oh, she's getting a. She's staying a low. Fire from above. Uh oh. Ooh, Hera's bridge. Pulling out the lasers. But he missed. It's hard to hit, man. You can hit lasers. I managed to do it. All right, go. Now Pirate Panda just trying to go in for as many short slashes. He needs to be in range. Uh oh, the spins. Another Harris grudge attack. Ooh, Coming from the Mirage. Her, and, uh oh. Did her hurt a bit. Pyro Mirages. 
It looks like Pyro's on the defensive right now. Staying low. See, uh, Luna's playstyle fits his, these weapons a little bit better. Assault Pyro rifles, he's able to stay above and, and rail down with assault rifles. Doing much better with these weapon sets, in my opinion. Pulled out the lasers. You should, you should probably change your stream title. Oh shit. I'm slacking, man. That's because I was waiting on you this whole time. Yeah, of course. You should have been cleaning yourself up. Well, y'all see how Shadow talks to me? Shots fired, shots fired. Pyro is just. And he kind was of late. Defensive. But Luna is right now in the red. Luna Fox is in the red also. Just to go oh, no, no, fucks is down. There we go. And let's go. Match. Pirate Panda takes the first win of the first match. Good match. 35%. Luna Fox did do better that round. She was at 45 the first time. Really good match. Luna Fox fought well. Pirate Panda gets it. Advance to the second round. I'm proud, proud of Pyro Panda because she was, she was talking about bailing out yesterday. She was nervous. I'm glad she stuck to it and played, yo. I'm so happy. Now we still have three other matches to go.